Hello guys, welcome back to Popcorn in Bed. Thank you so much for being here. I've got my comfy blanket, my pillow, my little guy, and we're watching Back to the Future. <laughs> Just kidding, we're watching The Mandalorian. I am so excited. I have been waiting to watch these episodes. I think I told you before how if you've watched my other reactions to this series, I just, I love it. I look forward to it. It's so fun, well done, adventurous, cute as crap, and I almost don't want it to end, but good news, season three is coming. I know that. This is like a legit one. Like, it's like got some heaviness and I just, so let's just jump into episode five. Remember, if you want to vote on polls, full length reactions, join a movie loving community, here is my Patreon. And then if not, just like, subscribe, ring the bell. Let's do it. Eon's past tell of battles between Mandalore the Great and Jedi. You expect me to deliver it to a race of enemy sorcerers? This is the way. Where can I find the Jedi? Take the Foundling to the city of Kaladin on the forest planet of Corvus. Find Ahsoka Tano. Tell her you were sent by Bo-Katan. Ahsoka Tano, bo -Katan. There's so many things. So in the olden days, Jedi and Mandalorian were enemies? I think I like that. Can you see, friend? <laughs> This looks, um, dire. <laughs> Who is that? I've lost visual. Have we seen white sabers before? Show yourself, Jedi. You will learn nothing from me. I won't give you that choice. Do I know her? How many lives is the knowledge I possess worth to you? Because of you, these people will suffer. They already suffer under your rule. Surrender or face the consequences. Is this a headpiece or part of her you biology? You have to decide. Cage him. Whoa, this seems like a whole new world. Corvus, this is the place. This is the I place. The beacon. I'm gonna start the landing cycle. You better get back in your seat. Hey, what did I tell you? Back in your seat. Of course they're going to the horrible place. Looks like Chernobyl. It's making me feel sad. What did I say about that? This needs to stay in the ship. Right, let's head into town. Bad guys. Looking for a layover. Nice armor. You're a hunter then. That's right. Open the gate. Pardon me, Vendor. Have you heard of anyone? <laughs> I don't know why that was funny. Pardon me, Vendor. Greetings, cashier. I speak to them. I just need to know. The magistrate wants to see you. This is... This is creepy. This is bad vibes. Okay, lady, share the wealth. You are a Mandalorian? Yes. A Jedi plagues me. I want you to kill her. That's a difficult task. My price is high. What do you make of this? I don't trust this lady for one second. Beskar. Here, Beskar. Kill the Jedi and it's yours. Where do I find this Jedi? Okay, pretty sure I had Clone Wars homework that I was supposed to watch before this. Forgot. 
I was just so eager to get started. So... What is that thing? I keep it around for luck. You're gonna need it where you're headed. I think that girl is known to the true fans. I'm a true fan. I don't know if I can say that if I've only seen everything once, but... I mean... <laughs> These are the coordinates. Keep your eyes open. We must be close. You hear that? Set right here. Let me see what's out there. No! False alarm. Ahsoka Tano! Bo Katan sent me. We need to talk. I hope it's about him. I love. A little hot. Eat something a little lighter. <clears throat> Hugs? Tell her the story. You rescued him, risked your life over and over for him. Is he speaking? Grogu and I can feel each other's thoughts. Grogu? Grogu. That's his name. Grogu. He was raised at the Jedi Temple on Coruscant. When the Empire rose to power, someone took him from the temple. Then his memory becomes dark. He seemed lost, alone. I've only known one other being like this. A wise Jedi master named Yoda. Remember Can he Yoda? still wield the Force? You mean his powers? The Force is what gives him his powers. To wield it takes a great deal of training. My task was to bring him to a Jedi. The Jedi Order fell a long time ago. So did the Empire, yet it still hunts him. He needs your help. I'll test yeah. him in the morning. Let's swaddle him up. Plus your deal. Let's see what knowledge is lurking inside that little mind. Did you see that little pat on the back he gave him? Oh, I love them. Now return the stone to me, Grogu. He doesn't understand. He does. The stone, Grogu. But he'll fall asleep. Oh. <laughs> much fear in you his head and his abilities to survive over the years let's try something else come over here he's stubborn not him you i want to see if they'll listen to you that would be a first i like firsts good or bad they're always memorable she sounds like um all right kid you know from Lift the firefly stone. and suits wash his wife grogu. Uh, no kid grogu oh. hmm. come on Take the stone. You see? I told you he's stubborn. Try to connect with him. The ball. Do you want this? Well, go ahead. That's right. Take it. I love how his eyes, like... Good job. Good job, kid. You see that? That's right. I knew you could do it. Very good. He's formed a strong attachment to you. Yeah. I cannot train him. What? His attachment to you makes him vulnerable to his fears. What? His anger. All the more reason to train him. I've seen what such feelings can do to a fully trained Jedi Knight. To the best of us. Anakin. I will not start this child down that path. Better to let his abilities fade. We must get back to the village. The Magistrate sent me to kill you. I'll help you with your problem. If you see to it that Grogu is properly trained, not even your laser swords would be able to protect you from all that firepower. Laser swords. When you were in the city, did you see any prisoners? Three villagers strung up just outside the inner gate. We must find a way to free them. A Mandalorian and a Jedi? They'll never see it coming. Whoa, that is freaky. I want to get off of this world. Sound the alarm. I hate that alarm. I miss Jedi's. What is what knowledge? We didn't hear about that. She wants her knowledge. 
Your bounty hunter failed. Tell oh. me what I want to know. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Where is your master? Kill her. Love to. Who's her master? Execute them. Then go door to door. <laughs> She's good. <gasps> I knew it. Get up there. Get inside. Ding. So you're through with the Jedi. Looks that way. In the magistrate fight. Think so. A lightsaber can't go through Beskar? Who do you think's gonna win? <gasps> cool tricks. <gasps> you and I were a lot alike. Willing to lay our lives down for the right cause. Which this is not. Sounds like you win. Nice try, Bucko. Behind you. He's so fast. Now tell me, where is your master? Where is Grand Admiral Thrawn? Thrawn? I believe this was your payment. Did she kill the magistrate? I can't accept. I didn't finish the job. No, but this belongs with the Mandalorian. It's the way. High five, guys. Where's your little friend? Wait here. I'll go get him. He's such a collector. He's got so much cool stuff on these journeys. Oh! <gasps> Wake up, buddy. It's time to say goodbye. Mm -mm. You're like a father to him. I cannot train him. You made me a promise, and I held up my end. There is one possibility. Go to the planet Tython. Place Grogu on the Seeing Stone at the top of the mountain. Then what? Then Grogu may choose his path. If he reaches out through the Force, there's a chance a Jedi may sense his presence and come searching for him. Then again, there aren't many Jedi left. May the Force be with you. Look at him! Still with his daddy. <laughs> oh! Okay, so Baby Yoda is Grogu. I mean, I think you look more like like a what's a cutie patootie name? I don't know. Just a lot to unpack there. It was kind of a depressing episode. That planet was no bueno, but I feel like we found out a lot. And they're going to the Jedi Temple. I think that's where Luke is. He's going to put you on a mountain and put out the force. But what if he doesn't call another Jedi? What if he can just adopt him and they can go back to that nice fishing village with the beautiful lady and the blue fish and just, you know, live their life together? I'm interested to see how that moth guy weaves into all of this and... Remember how those other Mandalorian told him that he's like basically in a cult and he doesn't even know it? That's an interesting thing going on. So I think we're getting into the good stuff. Okay, episode six. Grogu, 
<laughs> Grogu? <sighs> He's smiling under there, I know it. Okay, here we go. Come on, you can have it. His eyes. Thank Eric. No, I'm not mad at you. You did good. I just... You're very special, kid. We're gonna find that place you belong, and they're gonna take real good care of you. But you have to agree to go with them if they want you to. Understand? Don't you want to learn more of that Jedi stuff? Can't even, guys. I agreed to take you back to your own kind. Can't help so myself. So that's what I need to do. You understand, right? The tragedy? Don't love that. Looks like that's the magic rock I'm supposed to take you to down there. Sorry, buddy, I can't land on the top. We're gonna have to travel the last stretch with the windows down. <laughs> His noises. That jetpack sure is handy. Does this look Jedi to you? I guess you sit right here. Okay, here we go. Put your vibes out, baby. Stone? Are you seeing anything? Or are they supposed to see you? Oh, come on, kid. Ahsoka told me all I had to do was get you here and you do the rest. Time's up, kid. We gotta get out of here. We don't have time for this. Step out of it, kid. He is so special. I'll see if I can buy you some time. Please hurry up. <gasps> Scare me. I've been tracking you, Mandalorian. Who is that? Jedi, or are you after the child? I'm here for the armor. If you want my armor, you'll have to peel it off my dead body. I don't want your armor. I want my armor. I know who this is. Are you Mandalorian? This is Boba Fett. I'm a simple man making his way through the galaxy, like my father before me. What's to stop me from dropping you right where you stand? I have a sharpshooter up on that ridge. I'm the one wearing Beskar. I didn't mean she was going to shoot you. My friends locked on to that little companion of yours. And if you remember, I don't miss. Fennec? Who? Point that gun away from the kid. <laughs> Let's all put down our weapons. Tell her to drop the gun after he, you put down the jetpack. He just wants the armor. I mean, that seems like a good deal. Who's Finnick again? That's in Hunger Games. Thought oh, she died. She was left for dead on the sands of Tatooine, as was I. But fate sometimes steps in to rescue the wretched. In my case, Boba Fett was that fate, and I am now in his service. The armor was given to my father, Django, by your father. In exchange, I guarantee the safety of the child. The bounty on your little friend has risen significantly. So you were offering a fair deal under the circumstances. Oh boy. Okay, Django was the guy that made the clones and they made him after him look at me go, kid. his son boba fett was the bounty hunter Ugh. he got eaten by a giant sand monster but then somehow survived i guess and is now this guy and i like his accent and he just wants his armor back uh-oh <laughs> They don't have Beskar, that's for sure. They're covered head to toe, but they get him somehow. Not so old after all. That is quite the weapon. Hello, sir. They've got the high ground, guys. Uh-oh. But they've got those things. I haven't seen those ones before. Bazooka lightsaber laser thing. I mean, bazooka lasers. Bazooka. I don't know what a bazooka is, even. Okay, I might be wrong. Indiana Jones status. You gotta protect the child, Bubba, if you want your armor. Love her. Okay, I'm gonna protect you. Just stay there. It's 
gonna protect you. Oh! He needs to sleep. Oh, baby. Good. Get out of here. I owe you for last. Come on, guys. Someone got their armor back. Back to the ship. He's pretty BA. Nice shot. Is that boomerang rocket launcher guy come back to him? Better get to your ship. Who did that? The kid. That was Mothman guy. His ovary ship. Get the baby, get the baby, get the baby, get the baby. Flying stormtroopers? Whoa. Someone wants to be a copycat of the Mandalorians. <gasps> Hurry! Grogu! Are there humans inside those guys or are they robots? <gasps> get him! I'll do a loose follow. Where they had us. Mando, go get your jetpack! His armor needs a new paint job. They're back in the Empire. I can see the Imperial Cruiser with my own eyes. Go get him! Go get him! We gotta get a plan, guys! What about his... He's got a... Beskar... Um... Yeah, that's the one. That's the one. This is all that survived. I want you to take a look at something. This is me, my father, Jango Fett. Your father was a foundling. He even fought in the Mandalorian Civil Wars. Then that armor belongs to you. I appreciate its return. Then our deal is complete. Not quite. He said he would protect the child. We will ensure the safety of the child. The child's gone. Until he is returned to you safely, we are in your debt. Yes! Teamwork. Teamwork, guys. We're gonna get you. Oh, looks like you're nursing. Okay. Marshal of the New Republic. I need your help. Name it. I need you to locate someone in the prison registry. Last name Mayfeld. Migs Mayfeld. Sounds like a real piece of work. What do you want with him? I need to spring him to help me locate Moff Gideon's light cruiser. These stripes mean there are rules I need to follow. They have the kid. It's the one guy from the jailbreak episode, Bill Burr, I came to find out after. You leave my baby alone, you evil Darth Vader wannabe. Needs a little nap. Leave him be. You've gotten very good with that, but it makes you oh so sleepy. Have you ever seen one of these? You're not ready to play with such things. Why does his look so knifey? Put it in shackles. Send an encrypted message to Dr. Pershing. We have got our donor. Oh, my darling. They're gonna get you. Things are not looking good for my baby. Literally holding that thing, I cannot help myself. <laughs> it's embarrassing. Okay, I mean, the Mandalorian doesn't lose. He beats everyone, wins always, so he's gonna go get my baby. But I really like that he teamed up with Boba Fett and Trinity. What was her name? Same name as the Hunger Games. Okay, anyways, I like that we've got a team. We're got a mission. Kara Dune is gonna come in and we're gonna rescue baby Grogu. I hate the Mothman guy. Ooh, I don't know. Usually we end with a win and this is like a cliffhanger and I want to watch more, but it's 12, 15. So soon. I just love watching him be father figure to him. Like the little pats on the back and the smiling you could just feel under the helmet. It's so tender.
Okay, loving it. Can't wait for the next ones. Thanks for watching along. Until next time.